Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how you can fix PS5 slow menu and lag. So without further ado, let's get started. First of all, open up settings. Then you need to go to uh, system and on system, go to uh, system software and update and settings. And then make sure that update system software is fully updated. Uh, if it's updated, it should uh, show you up to date. Uh, if it's not, then you need to update using internet here, right? And uh, after that, if it's not working, then another thing that I suggest you to do here is to go to storage. And then if you have full PS5, maybe you have a lot of games and not a lot of storage, uh, first try to delete some games and try to free up your PS5 storage because sometimes it can be the cause of your slow menu and lag. And if it's not working, then what I suggest you to do here is to completely turn off your PS5, press PlayStation button, uh, then select turn off PS5. And what you need to do here, uh, when PS5 is completely turned off, uh, just uh, disable power cord, that the power cord that is on the back of your uh, PS5, and uh, just uh, leave it in plug from five to 10 seconds, and then plug it again. What it does is simply, it will uh, delete the cache files uh, of your PS5 console, and it could fix the problem. But if it's not the case, and then uh, when your PS5 uh, console is completely turned off, press and hold your uh, power button until you get first beep. And then you should get second beep as well, right? And after two beeps, um, you, heard, uh, you heard only one because I turned off the, the thing. Uh, with a beeping sound, I showed tutorial and I forgot to turn uh, that on, but you should get two beeps, right? And then if I switch on my uh, PS5, uh, then plug your controller with a cable, like this, and then you will open up save menu. Oh, and then what you need to do here, you need to go to, with, with these buttons, you need to go to restore uh, a clear cache and rebuild the database and clear cache and rebuild database. And after that, look if the problem persists. If the problem persists, then what I suggested to do here is to reset PS5, right? Press reset PS5 and uh, pre press OK and uh, completely uh, reset your PS5. Keep in mind that all the games, all the settings, um, default uh, ones will be, all the your, your settings will be default and all your games and all, all app screenshots will be deleted. So it's just like a factory reset and nothing you can do about it. So you just need to maybe back up your files, but just factory reset your PS5 and it should fix your problem if previous methods do not help, right? So yeah, that's pretty much it.